It's time for building that bankroll. Cha-ching is right. Uh, building that bankroll week one, we went three for four. Uh, the only person that let us down was Wade. He had a homer pick there taking South Carolina money line. He was wrong, and we have set a new rule. No more homer picks for building that bankroll. Uh, Tyler, start us off. All right, you know what, Cam? You start us off. Yeah, let the guests go. You know, well, I'll give a shout out to that guy that was uh, in y'all's Twitter comments the other night. You know, he's mm -hmm. a he's a big, big UConn fan. So I guess I'm taking Georgia State minus three over UConn this week. That's my that's my pick. So, uh, you know, I don't know anything about either teams, but you know, I'm just 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 well, take a shot at him. <laughs> According to his tweet at me, UConn covered the spread week one. LSU did not. So <laughs> they're 1-0 against the spread, but I like it. I like it. Go against them. Tyler, what's your pick for building that bankroll? Yeah, I went to uh, the group of five, treated me well week one, uh, but I think it's time uh, to go to the SEC. Uh, I'm going to go to a Pac-12 versus SEC matchup, and I'm going to go to Stark Vegas. I think that Mississippi State covers the 10 uh, versus Arizona. Sure, Looking at so. the last year's game, uh, it was a back and forth battle in the first half, and the Mississippi State's uh, offense uh, really took off. I think with Zach Garnett, I think that their defense uh, against a very experienced quarterback is going to shut them down. Uh, Arizona, it's a difference, uh, you know, playing out there uh, in the West Coast and going to to the middle of nowhere and playing in front of a uh, you know thousands and thousands of fans uh, ringing cowbells uh, for four straight hours. So I think that Mississippi State. The way that their offense is looking, they're running the ball more, uh, which is definitely something new for this offense. I think that's going to be a, a different look uh, for this Arizona defense. So I think that Mississippi State uh, is going to cover the 10 spread. It would not surprise me if they make a statement in week number two. Is Florida's old quarterback still a QB over there in Arizona, Emory Jr.? Or did he graduate? No, that was Arizona State. Arizona State. That's right. Okay. I have no well, idea what quarterback is at Arizona. He went somewhere okay. else. So my uh, building that bankroll pick for this week, it's a homer pick. Waco's not too far down the road, and I could hear the cries from here uh, as Texas State went into Baylor and just beat them up and down. They were, I think they were 26-point dogs, yep. and they ended up winning uh, 10, I think it was uh, by 10. To, I don't remember what the final score was. Uh, but Baylor doesn't have anything easier. They go on the road to face Utah, and Utah is seven-point favorites. Hammer that spread. Give me Utah by seven, probably by 20 when yeah. it's all done. I'd, said and I'd buy that thing up to 14. Yeah. I, I, would oh, take I mean, one it was, yeah. It was a bad performance by Baylor. Uh, I mean, you have TJ Finley, former LSU backup, who has been on like four <laughs> different teams starting at Texas State. And they just, they just ran them out their own stadium. So uh, take Utah minus seven versus Baylor. So we went three for four last week. Uh, let's see if we can go three for three. You know, we don't need Jacob or Wade. They're not on the show. We're going We're going with Chet, Tyler, and Cam. Let's go three for I mean, three. Make it a little easier to make the graphic. I just threw one out um, there. So, I mean, don't hold it against me if we don't go three for three. It's, <laughs> it's a grudge bet. What, what was it, Georgia Southern to cover versus Utah? Georgia or State UConn? to cover yeah. over UConn. Minus three. They're, they're okay. They're three point. I like it. I like it. It's a grudge bet. We don't. We oh, keep yeah. receipts, too. Uh, had to block the kid. He wouldn't leave us alone. I was trying to watch the game. I'm, I'll make sure to tweet back at him if, if <laughs> UConn doesn't cover with this clip. 